He said, what if uh, a passenger jet could climb like a fighter? The Boeing 757 doesn't just take off, it launches. Pilots call it the rocket. And once you know why, you'll never forget the sound. At lightweight, most airliners need every ounce of thrust just to get airborne. But the 757, it barely needs half. Its twin Rolls-Royce RB211 or Pratt & Whitney PW2000 push up to 43,000 pounds of thrust each. So much power that even a D-rated takeoff feels like a catapult. Pair that with a long, narrow wing built for lift and efficiency, and you've got the perfect storm low drag, massive thrust, and a climb rate that can top 6,000 feet per minute. In cold air, the dense oxygen supercharges the engines and the aircraft rockets skyward, pressing passengers back in their seats. It's so powerful that pilots dial it back on purpose, Reduced thrust takeoffs, sometimes below 50% power, are routine just to protect engine life. Even then, acceleration is brutal. It's the one Boeing that behaves less like an airliner and more like it's trying to escape gravity itself. Up to 43,000 pounds of thrust per engine, 6,000 feet per minute climb at light weight, cold air performance boost, reduced thrust takeoff standard, nicknamed the rocket by pilots. So next time you see a 757 claw into the sky, that's not takeoff power, that's restraint.